Hey guys, I am Kyle. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to cancel a Shopify subscription. So let's get started. So now here we are on Shopify and from here to cancel the subscription, you would need to click here on settings on the bottom left of your screen. And then from here, you want to click here on plan. And then this is where you can see your subscription or plan details. And now if you are really sure that you would want to cancel your Shopify subscription, all you have to do is click here on deactivate your store. And then from here, you can either switch to basic plans, switch or pause, start a new store or deactivate your store. And this is when you would be able to cancel your Shopify subscription. So you can just click on that. And before you go, make sure that you take note of this. So you have an outstanding balance in your Shopify account when you deactivate your store we will charge your primary payment method and cancel any unwanted subscription like for example you have installed apps into your Shopify store you would need to cancel them out first to, so that you can make sure that you won't get charged after you deactivated your store because chances are you, it would still charge you and then the next thing is that you need to save any needed store information by exporting CS uh, CSV files and then look into steps to take before deactivating your store for more information and so on. So once you have understood all of this, you have no complaints, you can click now here on this box and click on continue. And then after that, you would need to select a reason. So I'm just going to go for other reason and I'm just going to go something random, click and continue. And then after that, you would need to input your password here for your store so after you deactivate your store you will no longer have access to shopify admin including your sales data reports and so on and now just provide your password and after that click on deactivate store and then your store will now be deactivated and your shopify subscription or plan will also be deactivated so that is basically it for this video thank you for watching